Hello everybody. So in this video, I'm gonna uh, give an update video on Discovery Plus. As you know, uh, the stock price today, they released the earning and it was very mind-blowing good. Okay, but first off, let me give you an update on my mogul stock. As you know, today the price dropped. 17.7% and my and my $6,000 investment drops 3500 I still haven't sold any stock as you can see uh, the reason for the drop is there's two reasons first reason is because uh, everything's dropping so it's broad market dropping so there's if everything's dropping it's not it's nothing that I will worry about the second reason is because uh, they did a stock offering to buy, I think it was like, I don't know how much, like 50 million to buy the uh, coin square. So, that, so that's kind of like that dilution is coming. But I support the dilution anyway because they, since the uh, the stock price have gone up a lot, so it will make sense to raise some cash just in case uh, economy goes bad. So that's the reason. And so I'm, I'm, not, I'm not a financial advisor, so I could be wrong. So please do your own research. But just so you know, I still haven't sold any stock yet. Okay, as you can see. And let's go back to the uh, topic and talk about Discovery Plus. As you know, uh, let me uh, let me find my uh, stock and show it to you. I actually bought a stock. Like I say on my a video two months ago okay so i got a lot of stock on my portfolio so i got to uh find it first uh, i think the ticker symbol is oh d s d i s d i s c a okay i put around two hundred dollar on it so here Okay, I, I am having a major FOMO about this stock right now because they did such a great job for one uh, right now they have today they released their earning and they they just increased uh, they right now they have uh, the direct to consumer subscriber increased to 12 million and they just released the Discovery Plus seven weeks ago, and they added a astonishing uh, seven million subscribers on seven weeks. They are they are adding more subscribers right now than Netflix. Okay, I think uh, one quarter or two quarters ago, ago Netflix was adding like six or four million subscribers a quarter. And the subscriber plus is adding seven million on seven weeks. That is about one million a week. That is some crazy numbers. Plus, they are ranking very well on the apps, um, Google Play Store. They are ranking very high. I think, I think one of the reasons they are ranking so well is because their subscription cost is so cheap. Yeah, I I I think I just made a huge mistake not buying more stock at thirty dollar. Right now it's at fifty, so market cap is like twenty four billion. And if it's becoming ten better, this stock gonna be bigger than Netflix. Okay, another point I want to talk about is that a lot of people um TV or internet. Keep comparing Discovery Plus to Netflix. As you know, in my opinion, Netflix is not there is not a competitor to Discovery Plus. For uh, one reason, one for this reason is because Netflix offers fiction content. Like Orange is the New Black is fiction. Discovery Plus offers non-fiction content. They are on a two completely different category. So so it'd be like so it'd be like saying that uh, 
and like toilet paper and colored pencil are competitors. No, they're not. It's two completely different things. One is one is uh, yeah, they're kind of they're similar in some ways. They're both made out of trees, wood, but that's it. Everything else different. They are not compared. I don't really think they are competitors, but they are competing for time. The oh, there's the only similarity between those two, and and also people think Discovery Plus is kind of add kind of like an add on to Netflix. Netflix is the main channel that everybody needs, and Discovery Plus as an add. I don't I don't I don't really agree with that opinion as well. As well, because they are offering content is non-fiction, so they are offering content on a whole new category. Non-fiction means real, uh, re reality content like travel network, food network, history, a lot of content that's uh, real life. So that's what I think about Discovery Plus. Is they are doing absolutely amazing job. If you watch my previous video, I made a video about uh, Lionsgate. They have a subscription channel called Stars. Let's compare Stars to Discovery Plus. How they did? Stars. It took Stars one year to add a million subscribers. Just think about it. One year, Discovery Plus did it on seven week. One was buying the stock at thirty dollar. The market cap was around like thirteen, fourteen billion. Billion, thirteen forty billion. That's not a lot. Right now, it's not twenty four billion. That's a lot. Okay, basically double. The price have already doubled. And right now, like stars in the U.S., the minimum subscriber is like nine million. It took them four years to get that far. It only took Discovery Plus seven weeks. Seven weeks. That is very mind blowing growth. They are, I, I, there's no doubt about it. They are doing an amazing job, and the Discovery Plus app constantly ranks top ten on the Apple Play and the Apple Android Play Store. That's what's blowing my mind. I think when I bought the stock, and a lot of people and analysts haven't realized that how successful Discovery Plus is. Then right now, we saw the release, the numbers, it is amazing. Now, now comes the most important question. Will I buy more stock? Right now it's at 50, and 50 something dollars, and the valuation is 24 billion. That's a lot, that's a lot. I have to think about. Because the stock price double, yeah, probably. I'm uh, not really sure because twenty four billion buying it is is very premium price. Yeah, uh, I, I would definitely buy it if it drops. If if it if it drops like ten billion valuation, I buy some more. But twenty four billion does a lot, a lot. But my two hundred per two hundred dollar position is only up like eighty percent. So I don't know how much I oh it's like around. Like around Hundred something, hundred seventy dollars. So it's oh my god! I said buy more. Now I kind of like, kind of like uh, regretting not buying more Discovery Plus stock. Is so it is what it is. So uh, so this this video just give you guys an update on my uh, the situation right now, and uh, please subscribe and turn on the notification. So if I gonna drop like couple thousand dollars on Discovery Plus tomorrow, <laughs> I will make a video about it. And you guys know that I drop couple thousand dollars on it. If not, um, please give this video a like as well. So it will help me out a lot. So yeah, so that's basically the update. And um, you know, another thing I forgot to talk about since. Um, and the earnings call, the CEO say that they like they did a one billion dollar stock buyback. I think that's ridiculous. No company should do stock buyback. It's a waste of money because it's just buying back your own stock, and I don't think that's 
I, I know that the stock price will go up, but you're losing your money. I don't equate. I don't think it creates any value for the company at all. It just creates, this it just like, uh, this the shareholder got a little bit more rich, and you did, and your business go bad, your stock price gonna tank anyway. How about you use that? Use that one billion dollar to create more content. I think that's more useful. Or to buy other business that could one thing potentially save the company, like. If you don't have any cash in the bank, you're going bankrupt, you're bankrupt. If you have cash in the bank, you got more cash than debt in the bank, that would be impossible to go bankrupt, and that's a fact. So, I don't really support cash, uh, stock buyback. And the CEO did say that they're going to stop doing the stock buyback, buy back and invest most, most of that cash into uh, more programming. Uh, yeah, so that's uh, pretty pretty good news to hear. And, and, and one, another thing I want to talk about um, Discovery Plus is that um, Discovery Plus offer a linear channel, so like DirecTV, this network, so you can subscribe on those kind of like uh, cable network to watch Discovery Plus. But per user, uh, Discovery Plus, Discovery Plus per user ARPU, uh, average revenue per user is you make more money when a consumer like me download the Discovery Plus app on Android Store and pay five ninety nine a month. They make more money off me if I subscribe it on um, this network or watch Red TV. So that's a good news to hear as well. So yeah, so that's basically the summary of this video and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much.